Yo. <sighs> when did we play the uh, last POV? When? Was it Saturday? Cause I, I hadn't gone on my trip yet, right? No. It was yeah. It was before your the trip. The day before the so trip. It was Saturday night. Or Friday night. So Jerry's... What is Jerry... Oh, Keisha brought back that DVD. And Jerry's going to bring back the one of this HOH. With the planes and all that. Yeah. Does he bring back his own eviction? Yeah. That's what he brings back. Yeah, but April and Allie have been living in fantasy land between here and the jury house. Yeah, they're gonna. Their relationship is gonna take a turn. I feel like once they get out, we gonna put money on the. F I think he's gonna move to Arizona. We can put money on it. I just. What do you want? Time, time? time frame. <laughs> What's the time frame here? Like hey, within a month. Once everything. How, how are we gonna know? Yeah, I'm not sure. calling their ass. <laughs> you already owe me a two hundred dollar bar tab, dude. You think? You think I owe you? I need confirmation. Okay. We'll go on the website and it, we'll check the a CBS website. Go just go to ABC first. We'll <laughs> save some time. I'm telling you, it's not CBS. Now, if you're talking about Gary Unmarried, Wednesday nights at 8.30, <laughs> that's CBS. Dude, Righteous Kill, dude. The poster. I mean... Um, I wonder if that's going to be out. It might be... I when is that? I couldn't see a date it? on it. It's got to be come, either coming out soon or out, man. It's summer. They're not going to... I asked the guys. They said it wasn't out yet. Really? Well, they didn't think it was. It's got to be soon, though. There's no way they're going to release that too late. In this. I mean, it's going to be the last, you know... What day do they release summer? movies out here? Tuesday? That's weird, man. It's like a Tuesday or like a Wednesday night. I like to go to a movie from here. I've never been to one. I'll see if there are any. I don't know. Any Paramount movies coming out? Maybe we might be able to. <sighs> What's today? The 11th? Yep. 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, five, five days. Four nights. I bet I'll go by fast. Probably. So we know what they're doing Sunday. It's the best of show. Best of and then questions if they're tomorrow they might not show those till Tuesday yeah I don't know cause you gotta think they're gonna cut it down to maybe one one tape package cause you get what seven questions each question's maybe 30 seconds he said a uh, opening speech uh, answer all questions in a, in a, is there a closing speech is there a closing speech I'm excited, man, just to see what they're going to ask and have a chance to respond, you know? So I don't think any of them are going to be closed-ended questions where it doesn't matter what we say. I think they're all going to be interested in what we have to say, you know, at least. It's going to be weird to see the I'll questions see what they Keisha ask. Asking. <laughs> yeah, but hopefully they're not, like, stupid. Like, Keisha being like, why did you evict me? Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's like... Why do you think I evicted you, Keisha? <laughs> wow. 
What do you think they're cooking up in there, man? Sushi. Oh, we should. We probably should have said something, but I'll be happy whatever it is because we don't have to cook. I bet the jury house is nice, though. You know what I mean? It's not going to be a slouch. No, nah, I bet it's definitely nice. I think how bored they are, man. I Lee couldn't imagine. to be losing her mind. I couldn't imagine it. That long? Think about that. How funny was Jerry this morning? All right, your neck hurts. I never, dude, he was doing this last week. He would, like, complain about his neck and then go to his push-ups. And I'm like, <laughs> he's like, but it doesn't bother my neck. That's not the point, you dummy. Like, your neck's never going to heal yeah. if you're doing push-ups every day. <laughs> dude, that's the thing. Like, when I see him do push-ups, it's the hilarious thing because I'm thinking, that's a 75-year-old man, and then I think he can probably do more push-ups than me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Oh, that's what I wanted to tell you about. Um, you know when he said Ben there today? Oh, you know <laughs> I thought about, the same thing. I thought about or someone was talking about something. It was uh, Alcatraz. Oh. And Keisha was like, I've always wanted to go to Alcatraz. Ben there! <laughs> Every, I mean, he said it that loud, I, I too. And I was like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, I, dude, that's exactly what I thought when he said it today. That guy. The thing is, is you will never in your life ever live with a 75-year-old man ever again. And when you were saying, uh, let's see if you're a renegade or not, I started smiling. I looked in the audience behind Julie. I could see a couple of people like smirking in the background, <laughs> even though their faces were blurry. I wonder if Ashley comes to the live show. That's what I always wonder. Or Matt or anybody. I bet something. they came to at least one. It probably came week four. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about that, if they came. Showtime. You had two tries at this and couldn't get it done. But you didn't have any. You didn't have anything, uh, like wanting to just spin off at uh, Jerry. No, because yeah. at that point, dude, if I was a third person out, I mean, I'm, I'd be devastated that I was this close and didn't get any. I changed my like yeah. when I was thinking. I was like, if I win, I'm not gonna yeah. say what I told you. Well, you know what I was gonna say? I was gonna say this. I was gonna say, Jerry. You know, if you uh, if you take anything out of this uh, show, I want you to take sometimes. It's better just to keep your mouth shut. So on behalf of Judas <laughs> and the Womanizer, also known as the Renegades, <laughs> I vote to evict you. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. Um, but then I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, oh, can you imagine? Yeah, I mean, I just thought about being in his spot. You know, it's like you came this far and it doesn't matter. So, I did learn a couple of things along the way, it's, you know, especially reading that, just that one thing from my dad, you know, he's telling me to shut the hell up if I want to try to win. <laughs> but right. I'll tell you what, my friends back home were probably laughing their asses off at replacement nominee roulette, you know what uh, I mean? That alone will go down in Big Brother history, like, who the hell's ever done that, you know what I mean? I'm trying to think of like, we'll, we'll wait till later. We're supposed to talk about like the top moments and stuff. There's a lot of crazy moments, man. I try to relate, like go through like the eviction, like who left, because then I think that's the funniest. Remember when Brian left? There's just so many people standing around, you know? There's like 12 people just like, you know, there's that many people left in the house. Mm hmm. Like, he was here for the sock puppets, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah. That 
We had a lot of fun in the beginning, man. You know, yeah. screwing around. And... When did you know you could trust me? Um, I knew for sure. I think after uh, after that happened with Jerry, the Judas thing, and I s said something to yeah. her on live TV, and you were like, "Yeah, no, thanks, man. Like, really, like that's you know means a lot." Yeah. I think when when you said that to me, I was like, "All right, this guy's at least serious." You know what I mean? Because yeah. I, when I said that, I meant it. You know what yeah. I mean? Because that's how I am with all my friends. And uh, I think after that, I was like, "For sure." It's hard, man. You never know if you can ever trust someone in this game. You know, and it's you really trust good. the wrong person, you're out. You know. I think that's what gets people.